Hello there, everybody. My name is Michael Gray. And I'm Paul Franzen. And today we are playing Inappropriate Llama Disaster for Game Cola, Gaming Outside the Mainstream. What a what a wonderful title for a game. I, I feel like this one's really going to be a winner. Well, I like the background for my Yeah, iPad. that was nice. I like that. Yeah. So, Inappropriate Llama Disaster. Talk about this game, Paul, because you were the one who introduced me to I it. I did. Uh, I forget how I came across it, but it's um, an iPod game, I iOS game, I should say, where... Uh, you witness various kind of somber scenes, kind of important scenes, serious scenes, and you interrupt them by sending a llama out in a pair of roller skates. And you have to do it at the exact right time to cause the most amount of mayhem. So um, this is an example. Our first scene is we're sending in a llama at a funeral. Wow, you really jumped the gun there. No, I'm just demonstrating just what it's like to okay. send in a llama. I'm going to replay the scene and wait wow, for you the got act stars for that. Worst moment. So I got three yes. stars for sending in a llama. Hilarious. Yeah. So you're, you're you're supposed to find the perfect moment to really disrupt the seriousness of the scene. It's very interesting. Like here, a dignified service that that probably gets you four stars. Mm -hmm. But I sort of feel like maybe the game is just wait until the very end of the scene and then send. Yeah, that the was llama. actually kind of my experience playing through it too. Was was it was pretty? It was always like about halfway or three quarters through the scene. Let's see what you got here. Although we did learn you can get three stars just by doing it right away. So. Yeah. Oh. Oh, there you go. Nice. Five. Five stars. Do 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 do. And now we're trying to defuse okay. a bomb. <laughs> Scene number two, defusing a bomb. Oh, and we see a crossover with a character from Hatoko Boyfriend in the bottom right corner. I have no idea what you're talking <laughs> about, but is that a pigeon? It's a pigeon. Uh, the game is a visual novel, a uh, pigeon dating sim. Uh. Okay. <laughs> well, I mean, this dialogue here at the beginning seems kind of random. Yeah, would they, would they really be having this much small chat if they were... Uh... You know, actually doing this. I mean, they're not even. Yeah, they're not even trying to defuse the bomb. <laughs> yeah, complete lack of animation here too. I, I I believe I read that this game was made very very quickly, like maybe over the course of a weekend, just kind of on a lark. I think they came By up with the title and person? thought that was a very funny idea, and they tried to make a game that fit with that title. Mhm. Mm you know what? That oh, that could be interesting. That was the moment right there. What's the worst that could happen? That's when you send the llama in, man. Really? I don't know. It seemed like a good idea to me. No, it's it's when they they have a moment of silence for all the dead oh, people. Oh, okay. I don't think I ever got that far. Uh, sorry. What were you about to say? No, I I was going to make a joke. It's like, well, only one person made this game. <laughs> I, I I think it was a team. Uh, if the video were a little longer, I'd spend some time to actually look this stuff up. But by the time I get back to the video, it would be over. Yeah. Hey, nice. You already wrote a, a walk through this game, didn't you? I have not. You haven't really? Because that would involve, you know, like buying the full version of the game and, you know, purchasing the final two scenes. Well, you could do uh, the walkthrough just for the demo version. Oh. Well, that and it's not on uh, whatever you call it. It's not on game FAQs. Really? This game is not on game FAQs. Wow. Yeah, this game has the distinction of being uh, the first iOS game I ever downloaded. All the iOS games you could get, all the hundreds of thousands of games, <laughs> this, this, and this you was went the first. for inappropriate llama disaster. It was it was free and it had llamas in it. You were just looking for like inappropriate games, and this was the <laughs> one that came up. That's exactly it. I did a search I'm for guessing that's what happened. Inappropriate. Downloaded the first thing I could find. Come on, right there, right there. Oh. That that might have been the moment. You're that right. Pretty funny. Here. So very very strange game. Would you would you say? Very weird indeed. It has nice music though, which puts it above a lot of free free games. Yes, it's actually um 
for whatever reason, the version I downloaded does not include any music whatsoever in the actual scenes. There's music in the menu, but not in the scenes themselves. Interesting. I have the iPad version. Yeah. Perhaps that's how they differ. Maybe. Because I'm, I was ready to call the game, call it game of the year, but without the music, it's not working for me. Well, you can't call it game of the year. It doesn't exist according to game FAQs. <laughs> game FAQs is not the ultimate source on this. If it's on Wikipedia, game then FAQs it's has a lot of problems when it comes to iPhone games. It would probably list this as an RPG anyway. Yeah. No, but I mean, it, it will like list the iPad version separate from the uh, iPhone version, even though they're both exactly the same. Oh. It, it's the same exact game. Anyway, the president is yes. talking about how an asteroid is about oh. to hit the planet. That was a good moment. I like that. <laughs> he said, let nothing distract you. <laughs> so I send it the llama. I think if the scene continues, um, he says the asteroid is not going to hit. And the game ends right there, oh, that's... believe it or not. Oh, yeah. There's um, one or two more scenes you can actually purchase, I believe. Yep. Oh, there they, there they are. Two scenes. The party and the auction. And unless I'm mistaken, you can actually purchase bonus llamas as well. Different llamas? Yes. Yeah. And I'm trying to show the achievements, but I don't want to use the open faint, whatever that is. <laughs> I want to use, like, my iPad Achievement Center, so um, I'm going to open it up here okay. in a moment. Did you get... Wow. So here are the achievements. Wow, does the iPhone have that? I don't have an Achievement Center. Oh, it totally does. Really? It comes comes free. Wow. I think you have to register, like, a username, but yeah. I need to get some games to go with it, too. I don't think the Great Land Grab has any achievements. Oh, I like getting achievement points. <laughs> The whole reason to play video games. Anyway, that is it for uh, Inappropriate Llama Disaster. Thank you very much for watching, everybody. Bye, everyone.